Hello and welcome to Shavlik Protect. My name is Joe Andert and I'm a technical communicator with Shavlik. In this video I'll perform a patch scan that uses a custom XML file and then I'll review the results of that scan. So let's get started. In an earlier video I showed how to create a custom patch XML file. The file defined two custom products and a patch for one of those products. In this video I'll show how to initiate a scan using the custom XML file and then I'll review the results of that scan. Because the custom XML file is integrated with the standard XML patch file, the process for initiating a patch scan is unchanged. For example, The patch scan itself is performed in the same manner as any other scan and can be tracked using the operations monitor. With the scan now complete, let's go view the results and see how our custom patch fared. I'll start by examining the list of missing patches. This list contains an entry for the custom product named CRM. If I scroll to the right to view more details, you can see that the machine we just scanned is missing the custom CRM patch named SS13-001. You can also view the information about the patch that we included in the custom bulletin. And a custom patch can be deployed just like any other patch. For example, for more information about Shavlik Protect, go to the web URLs shown here. These two web pages contain additional video tutorials as well as a large number of Shavlik Protect user guides. Thanks for watching.